वेलकम टू कायदे आजम रेंजर्स स्कूल एंड कॉलेज नॉर्थ नाजमाबाद कराची आई एम योर कंप्यूटर टीचर मिस असमा तारिक टुडे वी विल लर्न अबाउट डेटा स्टोरेज इन कंप्यूटर एंड हाउ इलेक्ट्रॉनिक सिग्नल्स आर स्टोर्ड इन कंप्यूटर मेमोरी एंड द टर्मिनोलॉजी रिलेटेड टू द डेटा स्टोरेज लेट अस स्टार्ट व्हाट इज डेटा स्टोरेज when we will discuss how these electronic signals are stored in the computer memory when a computer is built it is provided with a large number of separate memory locations in the processing unit each location is given an address in the form of a number the computer uses this address to reach the required data but how is the data stored inside the computer memory locations bit bit is binary digit each binary signal 0 or 1 or electronic pulses is recorded in the memory locations as a bit a bit is derived from the word binary digit it is the smallest unit of data a computer can process or understand and all you know that one is represent the on signal and zero represent the off signal this means that all the data in computers is stored in the form of electronic pulses the size of a computer's memory is measured by the amount of electronic signals that can be stored in it but the memory is not measured in bits larger units called bytes are used to store data 8 bits represent 1 byte a byte is a combination of 8 bits each byte represent a character on the keyboard a byte represent one character in this example this is the byte for the letter c there are 8 bits that represent one character on one byte each Eight division in the diagram are the memory locations in the CPU. Each location stores one byte, one bit. A combination of eight bits make up a byte. The number of bits provided in each memory location is referred to as the word length of the computer. So we can say that the more bytes a processor can use, the faster it works. It can work things out. When we talk about memory sizes we refer to the memory size in the terms of kilobytes kb megabytes mb gigabytes gb and terabytes tb 1024 bytes is equals to 1 kilobyte or kb this is enough space for about 2 pages of text can stored in computer memory and 1024 kilobytes is equals to 1 megabyte mb this is enough space for about 5 books or one photograph or one minute of music to store similarly 1024 megabytes is equals to 1 gigabyte gb this is enough space for about 400 books or 1000 photographs or 16 hours of music to store one gb hard drive was introduced in 1995 and one gb flash drive was introduced 2015 1024 gigabytes is equals to 1 terabytes tb This is enough space for 400,000 books, about 30 school libraries, or 1 million photographs, or two years of continuous music to stored in computer. Let's recap: bit, byte, kilobyte, megabyte, gigabyte, and terabyte. Bit is the smallest unit, and the combination of eight bits represent one byte. which represent one character in computer's memory and 1024 bytes equals to 1 kilobyte similarly 1024 kilobyte equals to 1 megabyte and 1024 megabytes is equals to 1 gigabyte or gb similarly 1024 gigabytes is equals to 1 terabytes or tb
Thank you for watching this video. Stay connected with QRSC.